Uh, hello, I'm Tim McDonald. I'm an assistant adjunct professor at Monroe Community College in Rochester, New York. Um, I've just recently been trained in the COIL program and in the next couple of months, I'm going to be looking for partners to work with me on a couple different courses I hope to be teaching, probably starting in January. Um, first of all, let me tell you a little bit about myself. Um, I uh, teach actually a couple different courses here at MCC. Uh, one is astronomy and the other is geography, which is a very interesting uh, combination, but you fill in wherever you're needed. Uh, I'm also the uh, coordinator of the New York Geographic Alliance, which is a group of college professors and, and school teachers and other people interested in geography all across the state of New York. Uh, we are affiliated with National Geographic Society and uh, so we work constantly to try to make sure that our students are getting geography as part of their curriculum. Not an easy task in today's uh, educational climate. And that's one of the reasons why I want to work with someone from a different country, because most other countries treat geography a lot better than United States schools do. Um, the, uh, before I was a professor here at MCC, I've been here about 10 years now, I was also a school teacher um, in, a, in a school just outside Rochester for over 30 years. So I've been in the game for a long time now. Uh, so I feel I've got the ability to talk to people um, across the different levels, uh, both on the college, university level, and on the school level. Um, I'm finding more and more that if schools are not preparing the students, they're not going to be successful on the university level. Okay, now uh, what I'd like to be able to do is uh, to, to partner with the school starting next spring, or actually the spring semester really starts here in January, which in upstate New York is anything but spring. Uh, but we'll be starting um, around the end of January. I'm hoping I will be teaching a course on the geography of the United States and Canada. Um, so ideally, a partner from Canada would be great, but I don't see any reason why it has to be limited to that because other countries may be doing a similar type of course and it would be interested in their perspective. I know my students would be interested in their perspectives. Um, how do we view each other's cultures? Uh, then next uh, fall, probably starting September 2016, I'm hoping to be teaching a world regional geography course. And then I can see really no limits on who I could partner with. Uh, I myself am not sure about language preference. Um, I have a feeling that most of my students are not fluent in many other languages, although we do have a very large Latino population here, so many can speak in Spanish. But as far as the other languages, I'm not so sure. So that would be probably the preference would probably have to be in teaching and uh, conversing in English. Uh, I'm not necessarily limiting to the course to another professor if it's teaching geography. There are other possible collaborations that are possible. I was just thinking about this the other day. For example, in my US, geography, US Canada geography course, uh, it would be interesting to work with a professor that is doing literature, for example. How do they teach literature uh, from, uh, both, from both an American literature perspective? Like, how would they teach Huckleberry Finn to their students? Vice versa, are there novels from their country that our students should read to learn about the culture of Canada? So that's just one example, and I'm sure there's hundreds of more that uh, once I start looking for partners that uh, we can um, make that kind of decisions as we go along. And I think that's it, uh, unless more information is needed.